European champions, now Super Cup champions as well, but it needed penalties to decide it. How tough was it out there? Yeah, it was always going to be a tough game, obviously, the start of the season and stuff. But um, listen, I thought the lads put in a good performance. I just feel that we need to be more clinical in front of goal, but we got the job done and that's what we came to do is win the Super Cup. After losing on penalties at Wembley just over a week ago, did that feel a bit sweeter, Cole? Yeah, of course. Obviously, losing on penalties is never nice. But yeah, to come here tonight and win the Super Cup, yeah, it's lovely. Carl, you stepped up to take that crucial fifth penalty. <laughs> we saw you looking up to the sky after it went in. Bit nervy? Yeah, if anyone has played with me, they know that I don't like taking penalties. I don't like letting people down if I miss. So the gaffer put me as number five. Um, so I had to just so, you know, obviously the captaincy and leadership and, you know, go and take the penalty. And thankfully it went in and it was a winning one. Carl, your goal was the equaliser that, that got you back into the game in that second half. Fill us in on it, because it looked as though you said something to Haaland as he was leaping for the ball. Did you tell him, I'm behind you, and that's why you had the free header? Yeah, I think I'd have said my name, and then he's gone to head it and ducked, and yeah, I was just there to finish it. Do you feel like you're playing your best football right now? You've had an amazing summer winning the under-21 Euros as well. Do you feel like you're at your best? Uh, no, not yet. Obviously, as Kyle said, it's early in the season, like one of the first games of the season. So, yeah, I just have to kick on from it. He's been very humble. How good is he? 21 years old. Yeah, he, listen, this guy is incredible. Um, and he's got good players to learn off and obviously the best, probably the best manager in the world. So, listen, he just needs to keep going, you know, keep his feet on the floor, which he, he does really well. Um, and, you know, keep scoring the goals. He's got one in the community this year, one in the Super Cup now. So, listen, if he keeps improving, keep listening to me behind you, you you'll be fine. <laughs> Do you listen to him? Of course, sit next to him in the change room as well. <laughs> there we go. What was the message from the manager at half-time? Because it felt like the turning point in the game, Kyle, was early on in that second half when Nesri was in, had the opportunity to go 2 0 up. And after that, you guys just came into life. Yeah, I think, I think that's what good teams do. You, you know, you capitalise on people's mistakes and... We rode it a little bit, we rode a lot, but we, we got there and the main thing is to come here, you know, it's in tough conditions, you can see everyone's sweating and it's really hot, but, you know, to come away with this cup, what we've worked so hard for last season, to win the Champions League, to finally win this now and to put it in the trophy cabinet at Manchester City, it's a, it's a great feeling. Congratulations, guys, go and enjoy it. Thank you.